year 1967. The place, Midwest America, blanketed by a blizzard of 1967. What we are about to show you is the best clips that we have in our archives of the 1967 blizzard, which killed 77 people throughout the Midwest. You have seen past productions on this station, WTV Broadcast Network, when we gave you clips of the blizzard of 67. Now we're showing you a whole half hour of our best stock footage of Northwest Indiana in 1967. The illusion of emptiness and silence was reinforced by the knowledge that all roads, connections with the outside world, were severed. Even though the outside world was as near as the next block for many. One homeowner's cat got lost when it jumped outside and she disappeared in the snow. A five-year-old daughter ran out to rescue the cat, but she vanished promptly too. The father, up to his neck in snow, rescued both of them. The serious concern was the availability of food all through northwest Indiana. In downtown Hammond, hardly any stores were open, and a couple of grills were opened by the managers. All hotels throughout Hammond, East Chicago, were filled to capacity. So sit back and watch all these blizzard scenes from Columbia and Hoffman Street. You could see some of these rare scenes throughout Northwest Indiana. We've compiled a half hour version just for you watching here at WTV Broadcast Network. You said you wanted to see blizzard of 67 footage. We compiled that in one half hour show. So come with us as we tour Northwest Indiana and show you this devastating blizzard that was responsible for 77 deaths all through the Midwest. Thursday, January 26, 1967. The newspaper and weathermen was reporting that snow was going to be ending late Friday night. But they had no idea what was in store for them as the snow continued for three days. Heavy snow warnings were in effect all through northwest Indiana. They thought that the snow may total eight inches all through northwest Indiana. Little did they know the snow will continue for three days and cripple northwest Indiana to a standstill. These are scenes from when the snow actually started January 26th of 1967. Although it was about 10 inches at that particular time, later on that night, the snow fell again and continued to fall for the next two days. These are scenes from City Hall, just as the snow hit 
the owner of this film told me that they thought the blizzard was over and it was a thick snow at that time. Little did he know, the snow would continue for three more days in total of 27 inches. <laughs>